When I'm riding through your hood, east side be with me. So the pole at his chromosome, me with me. I'm back. Any nigga got a problem with this? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy T, you know, back with another video, man. And today, I'm gonna be talking about Mo 3. Alright, so look, man. Down the stone, in the corner. I'm that crack in the pot. I'm that strap that you got. I'm the one that they don't wanna. Cross that line when it's time to slay that iron. They can't fuck with me. If you understand what Mo3 is saying. Now it looks like Mo3 is about to heat the streets back up. Because Shots is Forever the Deluxe is on the way. So guess what? We about to talk about it. All right, so boom. Now Mo3 Instagram account uh, got an update today. And it's still weird to me when I see uh, updates from his account. But of course it's being uh, ran by management. So I'm assuming uh, Rainwater uh, is behind the account. In the older clip of Mo3 singing, uh, when he was in the prison jumpsuit, he was like in the jail cell singing. They uploaded that clip uh, to his Instagram page, followed by this caption. Shots is forever deluxe on the way. Now, I remember I told y'all that I was going to do an album review on Shots is forever, and I never got around to doing that. But the reason for me not doing that was because I knew that part two was coming. So I was going to wait until I could actually hear the entire album together, and then we can uh, do a review. But nonetheless, with the uh, success this year with Shots is Forever, a lot of people have been anticipating the deluxe edition to Shots is Forever. Now, I don't want to get anybody hopes up or anything like that, but of course, ever since, uh, well, even before Shots is Forever dropped, a lot of people was anticipating a raw wave and Mo3 collab. Now, I don't know what happened with the rumbles behind all of that, uh, but if I'm not mistaken, it was a clearing issue in the past. So will we see Rod Wave on Shots Forever Deluxe? Hey, who knows? Same with Moray, as I made a video about that the other day. So I'm definitely expecting some more features on this Deluxe album. But again, all of this is speculations. I have no inside scoop, no behind the scenes. So let's just get that out of the way right now. But one thing I do know, for sure, is what Rainwater said. And what Rainwater said is, Something to the extent of Shots Us Forever was just a, a startup. The real hard hitters is on the deluxe side of the album. And also, he said one more thing. If Shots Us Forever had that many people mad, oh, they about to be upset when this deluxe album dropped. Mad as hell. But it ain't my fault, so don't come to me when this album drop. I'm just telling you what Rainwater said. And I didn't do it. I did not go into the studio, write, and record these songs. That was Mo3. Not me. So take that up with him. <laughs> okay, I'm big old summer, yeah, y'all talking to a dead man. Why, I, I, I. But anyway, man, how y'all feel about this? Let me know in the comment section, bro. Like comment subscribe hit that notification bell man hey man follow me on instagram at tzf baby 252 oh and that second channel that i was telling y'all that i'm gonna make so we can uh talk about other topics that's not just only hip-hop related that's coming soon uh might actually be today but the next couple of days for sure so be on the lookout for that a long little mo three. I'm sound. And I'm gone. I'm sound. I heard the city don't like me. Prolific. Aye. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street.